Hello everybody, welcome back. Thanks for joining in. If you're new here, I am Nidin Philip and you guys are watching Nicks and Ains. Last week, we started touching upon a topic, how to restart your life. If you were in distress, if you were engulfed with problems and issues, we were talking about ways to overcome those issues and start all over again. We touched upon how to declutter your home and mind as well as how to do your daily workouts and thereby you can come back to your normal life. And today we are going to discuss something very interesting. How reading can transform your life and help the process of starting over again. Let's do it. I will show two scenarios here and let's watch those two situations. And you you comment in the comment box in which category do you belong? All right, let's let's see that video and we'll come back right to this part. Wow, books! I have a lot of books today to read and enjoy my day. Wow! Oh, who has put all these books here? I hate books. When I see books, I feel asleep. My dear, take this away. So you have seen two people. One guy really loves reading. That's very good. And another, he doesn't enjoy reading at all. Now, if you belong to category number two, stay tuned. I will try to convince you the benefits of reading. Let's do it today. If you have never read any book in your life, it is not going to be easy for you to just start reading all over again. So one of the simple ways that you can start reading is take a book and if you're not used to reading it, try to read the first paragraph of that book. And if you're not feeling comfortable, leave it aside and then you can do whatever you want and if you think you can come back and read another paragraph during the day do it otherwise try the next day so when you keep doing it in small quantum automatically you learn the art of reading so I was not a good reader at all I started reading books by practicing this method. So I, when I started reading a book, I was not able to focus at all. So I did start with one paragraph, then it went to one page, two page. And today I spend almost 30 minutes every day to read a book or a newspaper or a magazine. So this has become a part and parcel of my life. So I spend exactly 30 minutes every day to read something. Reading has a lot of benefits. Reading is one of the ways that you can exercise your brain. An ideal mind and brain are going to be the devil's workshop. So when you read, your brain keeps functioning as well as it gets a little bit of exercise. And then if you want to learn a new language, one of the easiest ways to learn the language is by reading a book. A book has got a lot of vocabulary, phrasal verbs, collocations, idioms, and you can, you ha you can learn quite a lot of stuff by reading a book. Another benefit could be you gain a lot of knowledge as well as you gain a lot of general knowledge as well. So when you talk to your friends and colleagues, you have a lot of information so you can be a star. And again, when you start reading a book, you can be in your own world. So you will be away from all the noises that are around you and you will be immersed in reading, which is in a way of staying alone and enjoying that tranquility and peace while reading a book. So when you read a book, keep this in mind. Every book is written by a human being. So the author has his or her own opinion about every aspect of that book. So if you think it makes sense to you, take it. If it doesn't make sense, you can just ignore it because uh, the life situations, uh, the experiences of the author will definitely influence in uh, writing a book. So if you think it is going to add a value, you can take it or you can just leave it. So I hope this video was informative enough. If you have enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up and write your comments in the comment box and don't forget to subscribe our channel and enable the little bell icon so whenever we upload a new video, you get notified. Thanks for watching. I wish you a lovely reading time.
सीरियसली 